What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is DigiBalgeD and welcome to another tutorial video for Transport Fever 2. In this video, I will show you how to add mods and play mods in your Transport Fever 2 game on Steam. It's not that hard, actually. You just have to know your way around Steam and with a new layout, it's even easier than before. First off, you need to start off Steam, of course, and when you open Steam and go to your library, find Transport Fever 2, click on it, and on these buttons here, go to the workshop. In the workshop, you can find all different kinds of things. You can browse here to collections, but for individual mods, just scroll down and the game automatically filters it for most popular. You can go to most subscribed and most recent mods, but let's stick with most popular for now. Let's see, what should we add? Um, we can go for vehicles, stations. What stations do we have? No stations yet. That's too bad. I was hoping for the curved station, but that's not made yet. So let's go for a new locomotive. Let's find a nice one. You know what? Let's go for the steam locomotive. Let's click on it. And once you've clicked on it, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And while you're at it, hit the subscribe button for my channel as well. That would help me out a lot. And um, if you like the mod and rate the mod as well, that will help out the mod developer out tremendously. In this case, Maverick2002. Thank you for making the mod, buddy. So, the mod is now in our game. As you go to your library, the game should update first. It's really quick with that, so I think it's fine. Um, next up, launch the game. And once you have loaded up the game, just start a free game. Wait for it to generate a map. It doesn't matter what you pick here because this will be changed later on in the custom game anyway. Go to next. Make sure you start a custom game. And make sure that you click on your new mods. I'll keep the no costs and the vehicle no end gear in the sandbox uh, mods on as well. So I can show the new items. We want the European maps because these are European mods. Let's go with Dutch town names because I'm Dutch. There we go. Make sure you save these settings or else the mod list won't start up. Once you've done this, see all this is gone and then you can start up the game. And once the game has loaded up, you can go and check out your new mods. Let's go to Amelo and let's just plop down an awesome new bus station that we have here. Look at these cool new rural bus stations. They look freaking amazing. Let's uh, place one right there. Oh yeah. Don't they look cool? <laughs> Amazing. Imagine popping those bad boys around the town. Let's plop another one on this side. Oh yeah, that one looks cool as well. <laughs> that turkey noise. Okay, that is the station we added. Let's take a look at the locomotive we add it place down some tracks uh, let's flip down a station on either side one there one there let's put down a zeppo right about there uh, there we go and a new line from here to here we'll call it test as i name all my test tracks and let's see what year does it unlock it's not unlocked yet let's speed up the time let's make it oh, i don't know 1900s seven new vehicles are available i think this is the one the A35, 
Let me check uh, the mod list. Workshop, my favorite, it's the BR18201. 1962. Okay, so we need to go to 1962. Good to know. 1962. BR18201. There we go. Apparently there are two. Oh, slight hiccup in the game music. BR18201. Let's add one of you. Let's add some passenger cards to it. Three. Let's buy it. Let's place it on test. And let's have a better look at it. Let's time a bit. And there it comes. Let's uh, follow it around a bit so we can have a better look at it. Now that baby looks pretty freaking cool. Oh, it has two, two people in there. Look at them. <laughs> awesome. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is how you add bots to Transport Fever 2. Let me know in the comments down below if this was any help to you and if you have any more questions about the game feel free to ask and I will make a tutorial video for them. So if there aren't things you had struggled with before and think that would help out a lot of other people then uh, make sure to drop me a comment. If you enjoyed the video then please leave a like and if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel for more Transport Fever 2 content and I would love to see you all in my next video. Bye bye!